In the name of Allah, most gracious, most merciful. Taha, we have not sent down the Quran to thee to be an occasion for thy distress. But only as an admonition to those who fear Allah. A revelation from him who created the earth and the heavens on high. The most gracious is firmly established on the throne. To him belongs what is in the heavens and on earth, and all between them, and all beneath the soil. If thou pronounce the word aloud, it is no matter. For verily he knoweth what is secret and what is yet more hidden. Allah, there is no God but He. To Him belong the most beautiful name. Was the story of Moses reached thee? Behold, he saw a fire, so he said to his family, Tarry ye, I perceive a fire. Perhaps I can bring you some burning brand therefrom, or find some guidance at the fire. But when he came to the fire, he was called, O oh Moses. Verily I am thy Lord, therefore put off thy shoes. Thou art in the sacred valley of Towa. I have chosen thee. Listen then to the inspiration given to thee. Verily I am Allah, there is no God but I, so serve thou me only and establish regular prayer for my remembrance. Verily the hour is coming. I have almost kept it hidden for every soul to receive its reward by the measure of its endeavor. Therefore let not such as believe not therein but follow their own lusts. Divert thee therefrom lest thou perish. And what is that in thy right hand, O Moses? 
قال هي عصاي اتوكا عليها واهش بها على غنمي ولي فيها مارب اخرى He said It is my rod on it I lean with it I beat down fodder for my flocks and in it I find other uses Allah said, Throw it, O Moses. He threw it, and behold, it was a snake, active in motion. Allah said, Seize it and fear not. We shall return it at once to its former condition. Now draw thy hand close to thy side. It shall come forth white and shining without harm or stain as another sign in order that we may show thee of our greater signs go thou to pharaoh for he has indeed transgressed all bound. Moses said, O oh my Lord, expand me my breast. Ease my task for me. And remove the impediment from my speech. So they may understand what I say. And give me a minister from my family. Aaron, my brother. Add to my strength through him. And make him share my task. That we may celebrate thy praise without stint. And remember thee without stint. For thou art ever seen. Allah said, Granted is thy prayer, O Moses. And indeed we conferred a favor on thee another time before. Behold, we sent to thy mother by inspiration the message. Throw the child into the chest and throw the chest into the river. The river will cast him up on the bank and he will be taken up by one who is an enemy to me and an enemy to him. But I endued thee with love for me, and this 
in order that thou mayest be reared under mine eyes. Behold, thy sister goeth forth and saith, Shall I show you one who will nurse and rear the child? So we brought thee back to thy mother, that her eye might be cooled and she should not grieve. Then thou didst slay a man, but we saved thee from trouble, and we tried thee in various ways. Then didst thou tarry a number of years with the people of Midain. Then didst thou come hither as ordained, O Moses. <laughs> And I have prepared thee for myself for service. Go thou and thy brother with my signs, and slacken not either of you in keeping me in remembrance. Go both of you to Pharaoh, for he has indeed transgressed all bound. But speak to him mildly. Perchance he may take warning or fear Allah. They, Moses and Aaron, said, Our Lord, we fear lest he hasten with insolence against us, or lest he transgress all bound. He said, Fear not, for I am with you. I hear and see everything. So go ye both to him and say, Verily we are messengers sent by thy Lord. Send forth therefore the children of Israel with us, and afflict them not. With a sign indeed have we come from thy Lord and peace to all who follow guidance. <laughs> Verily it has been revealed to us that the chastisement awaits those who reject and turn away. When this message was delivered, Pharaoh said, Who then, O Moses, is the Lord of you too? He said, Our Lord, He who gave to each created thing its form, then gave it guidance. Pharaoh said, 
what then is the condition of previous generations? He replied, The knowledge of that is with my Lord, duly recorded. My Lord never errs, nor forget. He who has made for you the earth like a carpet spread out has enabled you to go about therein by roads and channels and has sent down water from the sky. With it have we produced diverse pairs of plants each separate from the other. Eat for yourselves and pasture your cattle. Verily in this are signs for men endued with understanding. From the earth did we create you, and into it shall we return you, and from it shall we bring you out once again. And we showed Pharaoh all our signs, but he did reject and refuse. He said, Hast thou come to drive us out of our land with thy magic, O Moses? But we can surely produce magic to match thine. So make a triest between us and thee, which we shall not fail to keep, neither we nor thou, in a place where both shall have even chances. Moses said, Your triest is the day of the festival, and let the people be assembled when the sun is well up. So Pharaoh withdrew, he concerted his plan, and then came back. Moses said to them, Woe to you! Forge not ye a lie against Allah, lest he destroy you at once, utterly by chastisement. The forger must suffer failure. So they disputed one with another over their affair, but they kept their talk secret. They said, These two are certainly expert magicians. Their object is to drive you out from your land with their magic and to do away with your most cherished way. 
فأجمعوا كيدكم ثم أتوا صفا وقد أفلح اليوم من استعلا Therefore, concert your plan and then assemble in serried ranks. He wins all along today who gains the upper hand. They said, O Moses, whether wilt thou that thou throw first or that we be the first to throw? فَإِذَا حِبَالُهُمْ وَعِصِيُّهُمْ يُخَيَّلُ إِلَيْهِ مِنْ سِحْرِهِمْ أَنَّهَا تَسْعَى He said, Nay, throw ye first, then behold, their ropes and their rods, so it seemed to him on account of their magic, began to be in lively motion. فَأَوْجَسَ فِي نَفْسِهِ خِيْفَةً مُوسَى So Moses conceived in his mind a sort of fear. قُلْنَا لَا تَخُفْ إِنَّكَ أَنْتَ الْأَعْلَى We said, Fear not, for thou hast indeed the upper hand. وَأَلْقِ مَا فِي يَمِينِكَ تَلْقَفْ مَا صَنَعُوا إِنَّمَا صَنَعُوا كَيْدُ سَاحِذٍ وَلَا يُفْلِحُ السَّاحِرُ حَيْثُ أَتَى Throw that which is in thy right hand. Quickly will it swallow up that which they have faith. What they have faith is but a magician's trick, and the magician succeeds not. فَأُلْقِيَ السَّحَرَةُ سُجَّدًا قَالُوا آمَنَّا بِرَبِّ هَارُونَ وَمُوسَى So the magicians were thrown down to prostration. They said, We believe in the Lord of Aaron and Moses. قَالَ آمَنْتُمْ لَهُ قَبْلَ أَنْ آذَنَ لَكُمْ إِنَّهُ لَكَبِيرُكُمُ الَّذِي عَلَّمَكُمُ السِّحْرِ فَلَأُقَطْعَنَّ أَيْدِيَكُمْ وَأَرْجُلَكُمْ مِنْ خِلَافٍ وَلَأُصَلِّبَنَّكُمْ فِي جُذُوعِ النَّخْلِ وَلَتَعْلَمُنَّ أَيُّنَا أَشَدُّ عَذَابًا وَأَبْقَى Pharaoh said, Believe ye in him before I give you permission? Surely this must be your leader who has taught you magic. Be sure I will cut off your hands and feet on opposite sides. And I will have you crucified on trunks of palm trees. So shall ye know for certain which of us can give the more severe and the more lasting punishment. They said, Never shall we prefer thee to what has come to us of the clear signs, him who created us. So decree whatever thou desirest to decree, for thou canst only decree touching the life of this world. <laughs> For us, we have believed in our Lord. May He forgive us our faults and the magic to which Thou didst compete us.
for Allah is best and most abiding. Verily he who comes to his Lord as a sinner, for him is hell, therein shall he neither die nor live. But such as come to him as believers who have worked righteous deeds, for them are ranks exalted. Gardens of eternity beneath which flow rivers, they dwell therein for I. Such is the reward of those who purify themselves from evil. وَلَقَدْ أَوْحَيْنَا إِلَى مُوسَىٰ أَنْ أَسْرِ بِعِبَادِي فَاضْرِبْ لَهُمْ طَرِيقًا فِي الْبَحْرِ يَبَسًا لَا تَخَافُ دَرَكًا وَلَا تَخْشَىٰ We sent an inspiration to Moses. Travel by night with my servants and strike a dry path for them through the sea. Without fear of being overtaken by Pharaoh and without any other fear. Then Pharaoh pursued them with his forces, but the waters completely overwhelmed them and covered them up. Pharaoh led his people astray instead of leaving them aright. O ye children of Israel, we delivered you from your enemy and we made a covenant with you on the right side of Mount Sinai. And we sent down to you manna and quail. Eat of the good things we have provided for your sustenance, but commit no excess therein, lest my wrath should descend on you, and those on whom descends my wrath do perish indeed. But without doubt I am also he that forgives again and again. To those who repent, believe and do right, who in fine are on the true guidance. When Moses was up on the mount, Allah said, What made thee hasten in advance of thy people, O Moses? He replied, Behold, they are close on my footsteps. I hasten to thee, O my Lord, to please thee. Allah said, We have tested thy people in thy absence. The Samiri has led them astray. 
فرجع موسى إلى قومه غضبان أسفا قال يا قوم ألم يعدكم ربكم وعدا حسنا أفطال عليكم العهد أم أردتم أن يحل عليكم غضب من ربكم فأخلفتم موعدي So Moses returned to his people in a state of anger and sorrow. He said, O oh my people, did not your Lord make a handsome promise to you? Did then the promise seem to you long in coming? Or did ye desire that wrath should descend from your Lord on you? And so ye broke your promise to me? أخلفنا موعدك بملكنا ولكننا حملنا أوزارا من زينة القوم فقذفناها فكذلك ألقى السامري They said, We broke not the promise to thee as far as lay in our power, but we were made to carry the weight of the ornaments. of the whole people and we threw them into the fire and that was what the Samari suggested. فأخرج لهم عجلا جسدا له خوار فقالوا هذا إلهكم وإله موسى فنسي Then he brought out of the fire before the people the image of a calf It seemed too low, so they said, This is your God, and the God of Moses, but Moses has forgotten. Could they not see that it could not return them a word for answer? and that it had no power either to harm them or to do them good. Aaron had already before this said to them, O oh my people, ye are being tested in this, for verily your Lord is Allah, most gracious. So follow me and obey my command. They had said, We will not cease to worship it, we'll devote ourselves to it. until Moses returns to us. Moses said, O Aaron, what kept thee back when thou sawest them going wrong? From following me, didst thou then disobey my order? Aaron replied, O son of my mother, seize me not by my beard nor by the hair of my head. Truly I feared lest thou should say, Thou hast caused a division among the children of Israel, and thou didst not observe my word. <laughs> Moses said, What then is thy case, O Samiri? قال بصوت بما لم يبصروا به فقبضت قبضة من أثر الرسول فنبلتها وكذلك سولت لي نفسي. He replied, 
I saw what they saw not. So I took a handful of dust from the footprint of the messenger and threw it into the calf. Thus did my soul suggest to me. Moses said, Get thee gone, but thy punishment in this life will be that thou wilt stay, touch me not. And moreover, for a future penalty, Thou hast a promise that will not fail. Now look at thy God, of whom thou hast become a devoted worshipper. We will certainly burn it in a blazing fire and scatter it broadcast in the sea. <laughs> But the God of you all is Allah. There is no God but He. All things He comprehends in His knowledge. Thus do we relate to thee some stories of what happened before. For we have sent thee a reminder from us. If any do turn away therefrom, verily they will bear a burden on the day of judgment. They will abide in this state and grievous will the burden be to them on that day. The day when the trumpet will be sounded that day we shall gather the sinful, blear-eyed with terror. In whispers will they consult each other. Ye tarried not longer than ten days. We know best what they will say. When the best of them in judgment will say, Ye tarried not longer than a day. They ask thee concerning the mountains. Say, My Lord will uproot them and scatter them as dust. He will leave them as plains, smooth and level. Nothing crooked or curved will thou see in their play. On that day will they follow the collar straight, no crookedness in him, and the voices will be hushed to the most gracious, so that thou hearest not but murmuring. On that day shall no intercession avail, 
except for those for whom permission has been granted by the most gracious and whose word is acceptable to him. He knows what is before or after or behind them, but they shall comprehend him not. All faces shall be humbled before the living, the self-subsisting, the sustainer. Hopeless indeed will be the man that carries iniquity on his back. وَمَنْ يَعْمَلْ مِنَ الصَّالِحَاتِ وَهُوَ مُؤْمِنٌ فَلَا يَخَافُ ظُلْمًا وَلَا هَضْمًا But he who works deeds of righteousness and has faith will have no fear of harm nor of any curtailment of what is his due. وَكَذَلِكَ أَنزَلْنَاهُ قُرْآنًا عَرَبِيًّا وَصَرَّفْنَا فِيهِ مِنَ الْوَعِيدِ لَعَلَّهُمْ يَتَّقُونَ أَوْ يُحْدِثُ لَهُمْ ذِكْرًا Thus have we sent this down an Arabic Qur'an and explained therein in detail some of the warnings in order that they may fear Allah or that it may cause their remembrance of him. High above all is Allah, the King, the Truth. Be not in haste with the Qur'an before its revelation to thee is completed. But say, O my Lord, increase me in my knowledge. We had already beforehand taken the covenant of Adam, but he forgot and we found on his part no firm resolve. When we said to the angels, prostrate yourselves to Adam, they prostrated themselves, but not so Iblis, he refused. فَقُلْنَا يَا آدَمُ إِنَّ هَذَا عَدُوٌ لَكَ وَلِزَوْجِكَ فَلَا يُخْرِجَنَّكُمَا مِنَ الْجَنَّةِ فَتَشْقَى Then we said, O Adam, verily this is an enemy to thee and thy wife, so let him not get you both out of the garden, so that thou art landed in misery. إِنَّ لَكَ أَلَّا تَجُوعَ فِيهَا وَلَا تَعْرَى There is therein enough provision for thee not to go hungry nor to go naked. وَأَنَّكَ لَا تَغْمَأُ فِيهَا وَلَا تَضْحَى Nor to suffer from thirst nor from the sun's heat. فَوَسْوَسَ إِلَيْهِ الشَّيْطَانُ قَالَ يَا آدَمُ هَلْ أَدُلُّكَ عَلَى شَجَرَةِ الْخُلْدِ وَمُلْكٍ لَا يَبْلَى But Satan whispered evil to him. He said, O Adam, shall I lead thee to the tree of eternity and to a kingdom that never decays? فَأَكَلَا مِنْهَا فَبَدَتْ لَهُمَا سَوْآتُهُمَا وَطَفِقَا يَخْصِفَانِ عَلَيْهِمَا مِنْ وَرَقِ الْجَنَّةِ وَعَصَى آدَمُ رَبَّهُ فَغَوَى In the result, they both ate of the tree, and so their nakedness appeared to them. 
they began to sew together for their covering leaves from the garden. Thus did Adam disobey his Lord and fell into error. But his Lord chose him for his grace. He turned to him and gave him guidance. He said, Get ye down both of you, all together from the garden, with enmity one to another. But if us is sure, there comes to you guidance from me, whosoever follows my guidance will not lose his way nor fall into misery. وَمَنْ أَعْرَضَ عَنْ ذِكْرِي فَإِنَّ لَهُ مَعِيشَةً ضَنْكًا وَنَحْشُرُهُ يَوْمَ الْقِيَامَةِ أَعْمَى But whosoever turns away from my message, verily for him is a life narrowed down, and we shall raise him up blind on the day of judgment. He will say, O oh my Lord, why hast thou raised me up blind while I had sight before? Allah will say, Thus didst thou, when our signs came unto thee, forgot them, so wilt thou this day be forgotten. And thus do we recompense him who transgresses beyond bounds and believes not in the signs of his Lord, and the chastisement of the hereafter is far more grievous and more enduring. Is it not a guidance to such men to call to mind how many generations before them we destroyed, in whose haunts they now move? Verily in this are signs for men endued with understanding. <laughs> Had it not been for a word that went forth before from thy Lord, their punishment must necessarily have come. But there is a term appointed for respite. Therefore, be patient with what they say and celebrate constantly the praises of thy Lord before the rising of the sun and before its setting. Ye celebrate them for part of the hours of the night and at the sides of the day that thou may be pleased. 
Nor strain thine eyes in longing for the things we have given, for enjoyment to parties of them. The splendor of the life of this world, through which we test them, but the provision of thy Lord is better and more enduring. Enjoy prayer on thy people and be constant therein. We ask thee not to provide sustenance. We provide it for thee. But the fruit of the hereafter is for the righteousness. They say, Why does he not bring us a sign from his Lord? Has not a clear sign come to them of all that was in the former books of Revelation? Had we destroyed them with a punishment before this, they would have said, Our Lord, if only Thou hast sent us a messenger, we should certainly have followed Thy sign before. We were humbled and put to shame. Qul kullu 